more Wednesday night basketball here on ESPN after the break. set to begin a huge deficit right now and Jeff their body language is awful their body language mirrors their game disgusting terrible awful horrible does that sum it up Mike I can't get any clearer about how disappointing an effort this has been Houston's leading San Antonio by a score of 58 to 39. To Ginobili, he's averaging 10 points per game this season. And a nice finish at the basket. The assist from number 20, Manu Ginobili. To Brewer. They double him, double team, still puts it up, converts on the inside. He's got six points in this game. Number 33, Corey Brewer. Gets inside, spins inside for the shot. Jumper off the mark that time. Queued up and ready to go. Here's that play one more time. In possession. Puts it up. Won't go. It's hard to pass the ball out of a great double team because you come to their body where they have no room to pivot or create space to throw the ball out of the low post. Houston's leading San Antonio by a score of 60 to 45. to Lawson he's got four assists in the game it's good three-pointer Houston's five for six from three tonight and that's got to be so frustrating for the defense and their coach giving up another three like that they're not gonna win this game if they can't contain the three-point line to West Fires away for two, gets that one to drop. Hey, you can only control what you can control. The defense there was great. It was just a better shot. Beverly set to bring it up. To the basket, flips it up, won't go. I like it. I, I'm seeing more effort in the last couple minutes than we saw in the first half. It may not result in a win here tonight, but the effort is something they can build on going forward. Shot is blocked. To Bonner, down into the lane. A ferocious slam. And we'll have a timeout. They want to talk it over. The Rockets up by 14. Oh, that's a sweet finish right there. Dunking the ball with strength and force. Entering the game for the San Antonio Spurs, number 12. Beverly, and here's the double, wide open for three. And Trevor Ariza with a nice look from downtown. He's averaging 12 points per game this season. Again, that's another example of quality NBA offense. Moving the ball, searching the open man out, and then finally knocking it in. Aldridge is backing down in the low post. Ginobili. Fires that fadeaway, a three. Can't hit from downtown. Manu Ginobili's 0 for 3 from beyond the arc. To Beverly. Patrick Beverly with 13 points and five assists. The assist from number two, Patrick Beverly. Fires for two, gets it to go. The Spurs down by 17. to Harden, 
He's averaging six assists per game this season. The two defenders converge. And he throws it down. Listen, what you want to do right there is catch and gather yourself and get up quickly. It takes what most people wouldn't recognize as good strength and athleticism. Bonner against Howard. Aldridge is looking for position in the paint. Passes it back to him. Excellent ball movement around the perimeter. Green shot from downtown, won't go. There's the double team, slams it down. A look at the athleticism exploding up to finish with the hammer. Winding down the fourth quarter, there's a timeout. Diaz checked in again late here on the fourth. Back out to the perimeter. Aldridge on the drive, gets to the rim, puts it in, a two-pointer. The Spurs down by 19. Oh, that's nice right there. Good layup, good finish. to Howard. What a dunk. There's got to be earlier rotation across the lane to pick up the roller going to the rim. Good offense, bad defense, not a good side. That's why you're down in this game. Ariza has the double team converge. Nice ball movement. Harden against Diaw. Let's it go for two. And James Harden with a nice look sinks it. And that pretty much wraps it up. The rest of the game is a waste of high time. And this one comes to an end. The final.